hi there in today's video i'm going to show you how how you can generate the go pages for your website so as a website owner you really need to have these pages on your website it's a must okay so you really need to have the contact us page so the contact us page like the one we just created in the previous video which allows people to contact you in case of anything you really need to have it the second page you really need to have is the about us people really need to know who is behind the website who is the owner of the website okay so if you're thinking of making money with the website you need people to trust you so for people to trust you they'll need to know you so you really need to write about uh, anything you feel like sharing about you okay where your business is who are you and so on your services and so on okay when you're done with the about us you can go on to the privacy policy okay if you do collect people's uh details uh yeah like if even if you're planning of monetizing your website with adsense and so on you are going to need to have a privacy policy explaining what type of information you collect from people and how you use your information so that people get to know and if they don't agree to your privacy policy they should not use your website after that you can go to the terms and conditions okay so the terms and conditions i'll show you how to generate one in a few seconds from now and the refund policy is very much needed if your website is a business if you sell things on your website if your website is an e-commerce store people will, you need to have a refund policy there whereby people should know what happens if they would like to refund if they would like to get a refund after buying from you so that you don't end up uh, losing more money or time or and so on and having quarrels so let's get started so to do all this you don't have to write all this manually if you don't know what to write and if you're not sure so luckily there's a wordpress plugin which is going to help us with everything like this so all you need to do is go on to your website and search for legal pages and install this free plugin called privacy policy generator terms and conditions generated with plugin which is the wp they go pages and click on install when you're done click on activate by the way this is my demo website it's the one i'm using to teach you guys so once you're done with the installation okay scroll and find it so to do this just simply come to the left bar and click on the go pages which is over here okay so this is the welcome page just click on accept tick this box and click on accept once you're done click on uh, create page so you have to scroll down again okay so the first page we're going to create is the privacy policy okay so the privacy policy this plugin is going to generate for us the privacy policy so all you need to do is to go through and read it and you can add anything you like and you can remove anything you don't agree to so feel free to go through it and remove what you think is right and add whatever you think is right so when you're done with all this all you need to do is to click on publish which is this button over here okay so this page has been published so all you need to do is click on the view button so i'm going to right click and open a new tab and i'm going to read the privacy policy okay so this is our privacy policy so you can add it as you can see it's already there in the menu you can add it anywhere you feel like okay so let's add another page so we're going to add the terms of use okay so the term of use is also another name for terms and conditions although they are different things but they are similar okay so as well here again you have to read all and remove that which you don't feel is right and add anything you feel like adding if if you don't know anything to do just click on save if you agree to everything and publish when you're done 
uh, you can view it. So this plugin, uh, most of other features are not free, you really need to pay it, such as the refund policy, you can't get it for free. Only these, uh, these ones here are the ones which are free. So I'm going to show you an alternative way to generate a refund policy for your business. So to do all that, just follow along. So the good part is that Shopify actually has got a refund policy generator. So all you need to do is search for refund policy generator Shopify and it's going to and open the first link you'll see. Okay. So all you need to do is scroll down and generate your um your refund policy with Shopify. Okay, so click on our skip. So you need you really need to enter your, your details here, for example, company name. So I'm going to write Catherine's um Osaka and I'm going to enter my website. When you're done, remember to tick this one and click on send my policy. Okay, so Shopify is going to generate your refund policy and it's going to send it to email or you can download right after generating it. After that, you really need to read it as well, go through it and add it by creating a page on your website by naming it refund policy and pasting all that you've copied and that's it about it. Okay, so my refund policy is ready for download. So let me just download it by clicking on the get your refund for this. Okay, so this is the refund policy. So all I need to do is click on control plus A on Windows to select all. Then I'm going to copy. So this is the refund policy. So all I'm going to do right now is I'm going to come to my website and click on new page. And I'm going to call this page as refund policy. Okay. Then I'm going to paste all that which I copied. And after pasting, you really need to read everything and edit according to how you feel like editing and so on. So for example, this last part, I don't agree with it. It says if you're shipping an item over $75, you should consider using a trackable service or purchasing shipping insurance. If you want, if you, want you can increase this price. If you want, you can leave it. So I'm going to increase it. Okay, it's up to you. Okay, the other things you can do, for example, these ones, you can make them into headings. For example, shipping. Okay, so you can turn this shipping wedding into an, a heading so that it stands out and scary. Because people do, they don't really read these policies. So you really need to make them eye catching. Okay. So we can do the rest and finish up everything. And when I'm done, just click on publish. Then that's it. So this is how you generate the Google pages for your website. Okay, so it depends on what type of website you have, uh, what website is all about. Certain websites require specific terms and conditions and privacy and policy. So it's up to you. You can just research online or you can contact me and I'll advise you better. So if you're new to this channel, this channel is all about tutorials, money making opportunities, and so on. To keep on receiving this type of videos, make sure that you subscribe, like to support me, comment if you have questions. Bye for now.